MMA rants and raves, UFC 114, Rogerio Noguera versus Jason Brills. Guys, UFC 114 was a great card, action-packed, shocking endings. They basically had everything you would want in a card. But of course, there was one big disappointment, and that was the Brills Noguera fight. Very disappointing, very disappointing. Now, let's talk about this fight. Uh, first two rounds, you really see Brills taking it to Noguera, basically beating him in almost every aspect. I mean, he was out striking him. He was doing very well on the ground as well. He was getting takedowns. And it just seemed that he was the dominant fighter. He was the better fighter for the first two rounds. I mean, I, I don't see how Noguera was winning those two rounds. It was basically Brills. And then they get to the third round, and you basically see a lot of the same. You see Brills dominant in the stand-up. They get on the ground, it was really interesting. I would say on the ground, with the submission attempts, it was the most incredible thing that uh, they really couldn't get the dominant position on each other. They were just rolling around. One guy seemed to have one guillotine connected, and then the other guy seemed to have the other guillotine. Third round was close. You see Brills, though, with one takedown, like towards the end, and it was reversed, and then reversed again, and then close to when the bell sounds, you basically have no care on top. And I just thought to myself, I said, you know something? This was a really good fight. I see Brills winning the first two rounds. And the third round was close. And then what happened was, it was a split decision. And I just said, you know what? Come on, they got to give this to Brills. And then they give it to Noguera. And I was just really disappointed. Because this guy, he just fought his heart out. A lot of people didn't give him a chance to win the fight. It would have been huge for his career. It may have even put him in the mix in the light heavyweight division. And it's just horrible to lose a fight like that. And you know something they say, don't put it in the hands of the judges? You know, okay, there is an... I mean, there's something to that. But think about it. You know, not everything is striking. Okay, you have to finish a fight. What does it mean, knock a guy out? What if you have a guy who's a wrestler, you have a guy who's a grappler? You know, what do you mean, finish a fight? You know, it takes time to implement the submission. You need to get someone to the ground. What about controlling a fight? Don't they look at that? You know, that's also important. And I just saw Brills winning this fight. I really don't see how Noguera deserved this decision. And of course, it was a split decision. And to credit to the judges, it was a close fight. But you have to look at the entire fight. And if you look at the entire fight, the conclusion that I came to was that Brills won this fight. So it's very disappointing. I mean, that's the way I see it. And I'd like to ask you guys out there in the audience. I mean, you tell me. Who do you think won this fight? Jason Brills or Rogerio Noguera? Please leave comments below the video. Let me know. Please subscribe and rate this video. And thank you for tuning in.